Hey everyone, Christopher Beast here, and today I'll be reviewing everything that was changed in the recent Machine Gun Tweak update, or 13.1.0.68. This is an update that saw a series of nerfs to the entire MG category, with the goal to finally knock the MGs out of the number one swap that they had been occupying. So with no more delay, let's just get right into this. Starting off, the MG3 now has greater and faster bloom and horizontal recoil. The KK-62 is greater and faster bloom with a decrease in horizontal recoil. The RPK has increased starting spread and greater and faster bloom as well as an increase in horizontal recoil. The M60 has greater starting spread and greater and faster bloom. The BGM has greater and quicker bloom. The UKVZ-59 has greater and quicker blue. The ZAM-72 has increased starting spread, greater and faster bloom, as well as increased horizontal recoil. The M249 has received some of the largest degree of changes, which will solidly knock it out of the top region. With increased vertical recoil, increased horizontal recoil, greater and faster bloom, and total recoil on the last bullet being slightly increased. So all around, the 249 is really not a top contender anymore. The RPK-74 has quicker and greater bloom, as well as increased horizontal recoil. And finally, the L86A1SW has greater and quicker bloom, as well as some minor tweaks to its horizontal recoil. To conclude, this is the death blow update for the MG meta, which will likely now be replaced once again by AR dominance, as it was prior to these updates. Um, the guns received back at the start of the season, so some of these guns have been practically set back to their pre-buff status. I mean, a lot of them still are slightly stronger than where they started, but I don't really know if there's any real chance that any of them have any real matter in the balance or the meta at this point. That's all I've got. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time, this has been Chris Beast. Ciao. Thank you.